stopper. Uh, today I want to show you my new project. It's a resonant cavity, uh, do it yourself. It consists of two parts from the base and uh, cells. Uh, the base uh, of a resonant cavity uh, is made of derlin. Derlin is uh, the same material as used Stanley Myers. Chemical name is polyacetal. Uh, the technical name, if you want to find it at internet or buy it, it's POM C. It's a normal white or black rod, whatever you order. This is 35 millimeter uh, diameter. Mm, it was half a meter long. Um, it has a good uh, dielectric properties. Uh, and um, uh, I made a project uh, and uh, great thanks to Dinadan that encouraged me to make it. Um, this is uh, one half uh, 65 millimeters uh, tall um, and it has two uh, holes diameter 20.1 one millimeter and the second one is longer uh, for 60 16 uh, point one diameter this one is five millimeter this one is six centimeter long here is a, a small uh, hole for uh, water inlet and gas outlet just like this this is the same but uh, the difference between these two is that this has a two holes for screw M6 uh, and uh, with this screw we put a, a positive and a negative of power supply into the cell. Here goes the positive, here goes the negative. This um, plastic will be for uh, isolating uh, and covering these uh, two screws for minimizing the current leakage. This will be the wires that will uh, connect these two with the power supply. Um, <clears throat> I, I made it at the, uh, with my friend uh, at the lath uh, and um, uh, it wasn't uh, very complicated to make it. The second part is uh, my uh, tubes. And these are two tubes. Uh, material is uh, stainless steel, seamless pipes, uh, 304, the same as uh, Stanley Myers used. This is 20 millimeters, this is 16 millimeters diameter. Uh, both are 1.5 millimeter thick. And <clears throat> this is the cathode. This is the anode, and uh, as you can see, uh, this is the anode. It has two uh, holes. Uh, this also here, so four holes. <coughs> Stanley Myers used uh, for anode uh, rod. I used tubes. It's uh, cheaper, and um, it was full of uh, inside um, the tube isn't full inside so I need to uh, use an epoxy uh, to fill it out and make it solid for uh, not to water uh, inflow <coughs> and um, uh, the uh, the uh, maybe I show how it's functioning um, so these two tubes are in uh, in uh, <coughs> in a vase and uh, uh, here the water inflows outflows here it uh, gets into the gap between these two electrodes and it goes uh, by this hole into the um, inside of the uh, negative and here is the outflow of the water and the gas flow so uh, I will mount it in, in, a, in, my ba in this base um, 
Uh, it's easy to mount or unmount if you want to clean them up. Uh, also here I put some uh, epoxy to isolate the inside of the negative tube and um, uh, at the uh, up I give uh, this Derlin base and uh, so this uh, this is how it looks this is the first hole at the bottom this is uh, at the upper side and here goes out the uh, gas uh, outflow it's good uh, isolated here we have uh, a screw first screw for the negative it touches the negative it touches the positive And um, mm, what I wanted to achieve uh, with this uh, project uh, is uh, that uh, I get these two tubes uh, with a um, uh, gap uh, that I achieved is 0 0.5 millimeter. Uh, my previous cells. Uh, this one is very old uh, cells um, with uh, is, uh, plastic spacers had a 1.5 millimeter um, so it's a uh, three times smaller gap than we uh, get uh, in this uh, resonant cavity um, uh, it's not uh, so complicated to make it you can use a rod uh, as you want um, and um, uh, it's easy to unmount uh, it's easy to make uh, the cost uh, of uh, make uh, making this uh, um, project it's about uh, 30 dollars so it's not so uh, very expensive uh, which uh, I, I want to uh, make it properly for the negative screw okay it's the maximum that it can get it also um, I will take a meter to show you uh, I take a meter to show you this is the testing point and uh, let's try is it is it shorting its maximum uh, put it inside the to tube you cannot uh, move it uh, more it's not it's not getting short so see it's not shorting we change it and it's not shorting uh, with uh, normal with dead spacers it would be very uh, hard to achieve a 0 0.5 millimeter uh, uh, gap um, I wanted to, to achieve such a gap because the Stanley Myers told that the smaller the gap the bigger the production with the same um, with the same uh, with the same uh, power uh, put it into the uh, cells um, and I will uh, try to uh, try it so this is the negative this is the negative this is also isolated here Okay, and so thanks, bye.